What is going on everyone? Welcome to Gym Lister All, where we teach you how to get fit and strong outside the gym. I'm Pat Chadwick, a calisthenics coach with over four years of experience in helping students from all over the world achieve their calisthenics goals. In this video, I'll be walking you through how to do knee push-ups. Knee push-ups is a body weight pushing exercise that will help to develop your upper body strength towards achieving the full push-up. Therefore, this exercise is great for those who are at the beginner's level. This exercise targets the same muscle groups and have the same movement path as the full push-up. Therefore, you will reap the same benefits just from practicing this. What muscles are worked by knee push-ups? Well, the primary muscles are your pectoralis major, your triceps, and your anterior deltoids, as well as secondary muscle groups, which are your abdominals, the obliques, serratus anterior and your quadriceps all right so i'll now demonstrate to you how to do knee push-ups so first of all we're going to get on all fours hands about shoulders width apart shoulders stacked directly on top of your wrist and your fingers are facing forward then we're going to stretch our knees back to and then engage in the core and the glutes to ensure that our back is in a straight line you can keep your feet together or cross them over like this then we're going to gradually lower down we're going to inhale and we're going to lower down keeping our core engaged so inhale lower down until your elbows is about 90 degrees or almost a right angle and then we're going to exhale as we push up squeeze the core squeezing the pecs together and squeezing right at the top before lowering back down inhale Alright, so the second variation to the knee push-ups is wall push-up. You're going to aim to do this between 5 to 12 reps for 4 sets. So what you're going to do is stand about 1, 2 feet away from the wall and extend our arms out fully. Shoulders should be in line with the wrist. Engage your glutes, engage your core. What we're going to do is we're going to bend our arms, coming close to the wall as possible and then push back. This is a beginner's exercise because the majority of your weight will be on your feet rather than your upper body. Therefore, which makes it a great progression towards the knee push-up and achieving the push-up. So I'm going to do this for a few more reps. You can also play around with the angle. So you can do wide grip, wall push-up. Shoulders width. Remember to engage your core and your glutes the entire way, or diamonds. The third variation is the diamond knee push-ups. This variation is the progression from the knee push-up as it limits the involvement of the pecs and put more isolation on your triceps due to your hands be in this triangle shape all right so what we're gonna do is form a triangle shape and place it at the center of your chest make sure that our shoulders is stacked directly on top of your wrist we're gonna extend our knees out just a little bit engage your glutes engage your core either keep your feet together or cross them then we're gonna gradually lower down inhale as we do so exhale push back up <sighs> squeeze right at the top inhale Exhale, squeeze back up. You want to keep your elbows close to your body and not flared out. All right, so the next variation I'll show you is the negative push-up. This is really great for building up your upper body strength towards achieving a full push-up because of the eccentric part. This will increase time under tension on your muscles as well as improving your core stability which will prepare your muscle for the full push-up. So 
To begin, we're gonna get into a plank position. So hands shoulders width apart, shoulders stacked directly on top of your wrist. Extend your legs out, engage your glutes, engage your core, your feet together, and make sure that your body is in a straight line. <clears throat> then we're gonna lower down slowly. So we're gonna inhale and we're gonna lower down about three to five seconds lowering down and that's one rep you're going to be able to do this for around two to six reps for four sets so lower down inhale as you do so feel the resistance of your body on your chest and on your triceps working against gravity lower down Alright, so the last variation that I'll be showing you is the full push-up. This should be your ultimate goal and if you practice the previous variations that I've showed you consistently for three to four times a week for about three to four weeks, you should be able to do full push-ups easily. Alright, so let's begin. So we're gonna get into a plank position, shoulders stacked directly on top of your wrist, hands are about shoulders width apart, stretch your legs back, engage your glutes, engage your core. Then we're gonna lower down and inhale as we do so. If you inhale and lower down until your elbows are about 90 degrees or at a right angle. And then exhale, push back up. Inhale, exhale, push back up. Inhale, exhale, push back up. So what are the benefits to knee push-ups? One, it will increase your upper body strength as knee push-ups is a compound exercise which means that many muscle groups are being worked at the same time to achieve one movement. So your chest, your triceps, your abdominals, your quads. Two, improve balance and stability. Doing knee push-ups will recruit your core to prevent your body from toppling over. Therefore, it will train your microscopic nerves which will in turn improve your balance and stability. Three, no equipment needed. You can use your body weight as resistance and you'll have a great workout from it. So there you have it. In this video, I've showed you how to do knee push-ups as well as covering five different variations to spice things up so that you can practice on your knee push-ups today. If you have any questions regarding these exercises, please let me know in the comment section below and I'll get back to you. Thank you and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching guys, check us out at gymless.org for more tutorials and please like and subscribe.